Press cross button. Ready to go? About time. My apologies. Claire used to broadcast from somewhere around here. That's all I've got, I'm afraid. Bloody analog technology. If we could pick up her trail, that means someone else can. Let's find her quick and beat the bad guys to the punch. Got her. No matter where I end up, it's still the same story. The same shitty ending. I'd love to listen to you moan all day, but perhaps investigating her murder would be a better use of our time. Right. We'll nail those bastards to the wall. Let's see what we can find. What do you make of all these footprints, Bagley? Several individuals. Boots rather than shoes. One with a tread unique to a certain paramilitary supplier. I think it's from their autumn collection. What the hell was Albion doing here? Clan Kelly graffiti. And a lot of it. Claire did release several podcasts critical of Clan Kelly, which you'd think they'd be used to by now. They're a criminal gang, they shouldn't expect flowers and thank you notes. Yeah, but they don't need to advertise. Something's off about this.
Claire's killers didn't quite get everything. Can you scan her tablet, Bagley? Tablet unlocked. Claire seems to have logged conversations on it. Okay, you've agreed to speak on the record. You are an intelligence technician at Albion and work closely with Nigel Cass, correct, Mr...? Just you. I can't believe I'm doing this. If they were to find out. I know. Only have to step outside to see how Albion treats people. What do you have for us? Proof that... <sighs> Proof that Nigel Cass was complicit in the bombings. What? But that's... Here, transfer it to this secure storage drive. How solid is this information? It's a recording of him talking to some... Insecurity, drop your weapons! You can't do this! Gather all our equipment and get it in a carousel. Do! Take that wall, then get rid of this body. She can stay here. <laughs> Gang vengeance is an horrible crime, ain't it? Fuck me. Cass sent a squad of his goons for Claire and that other bloke. That recording's got to be the real deal. Bastard knew about the bombings. Albion must have Claire's equipment then, along with the audio file evidence. I bet even Nigel Cass wouldn't be able to bullshit his way through this kind of evidence. He mentioned Carousel. Must mean Carousel Plaza, the Albion Propaganda Library. Sounds like as good a place as any to start looking. The stolen evidence is here somewhere. Watch out, Albion security is thicker than whoever cleaned up that crime scene. There's also a lot of them around. You know, I'd like to see them try me on for size. Yes, well, let's focus on finding Claire's equipment, shall we?
down Claire's equipment, including her secure storage drive, which shockingly appears not to have been tampered with, so the audio evidence is probably still intact. Dispatch, deploy drones to apprehend the suspect. Come on, out with you!
I thought we warned you about trespassing, yeah? That's right. Didn't learn your lesson, huh? Please, I was just taking a picture of the exterior for... Oh, did you hear that, mate? He was taking a picture. <laughs> a bloody picture! <laughs> now, listen here, you knob. This is going to be our final warning to you. If we ever see you coming around here again, the police are going to have to put out a missing persons report. And I think you know how effective they are these days, yeah? Oh, I understand. Well, I know you're listening. Let's talk. We told you the Prime Minister would turn you down. Brits love to see private military contractors on foreign streets, but not their own. He's a fool! This whole city, this whole country's collapsing. The military's held together with duct tape. The police are running scared. Someone has to save the people, Nigel. Someone strong. <laughs> they do. But I've already worked it out. The ideal targets are the Toan Conference, Parliament, and King's College Hospital. I'll provide overseas tag teams for logistics, but you can source the bombs yourself. Non-negotiable. It cannot trace back to me. You're forgetting something. And I'll get you access to filament, as agreed. Now go away. Now Scarpa, or they'll kill you for sure. has a voice that makes you want to snap his smug bollocks in a pencil case, doesn't he? And Zero Day knew just which strings to pull to get what they wanted, didn't they? Filament. And Cass was willing to trade it for the keys to the city. Fuck. Don't know, fam. I think I always thought there was a chance for him to... Fuck! To be the man you thought he was. Sorry, Hamish. If that man ever existed, he's gone now. We have to get this information out there to the people. You're right. When you lot get the chance, come to Piccadilly Circus. Been working with back. on something. And this proof is just the token we needed. Here we go.
officers are employed to ensure safety for all. London, you've been lied to. Nigel Cass and his Albion peacekeepers intend to permanently control his city. The ideal targets are the Tone Conference, Parliament and King's College Hospital. I'll provide overseas tech teams for logistics, but you can source the bombs yourself. Non-negotiable, it cannot trace back to me. Nigel Cass collaborated with a terrorist to bomb this city. Then, he set up an orbital drone program called Themis that will target you based on your stolen data. I will not allow anyone, not even myself, to jeopardize Themis. I've given you the truth. Do as you will. Actually, fuck that. Resist. Not bad, not bad if I do say so, innit? Hey, Hamish. Haha. <laughs> Thought you weren't risking your pretty face. Yeah, well, can't lock myself away from the world forever. Got a lot to make up for, don't I? Besides, you sorry lot need all the help you can get. Check it. Fucking wankers! Yeah, the whole of Albion won't just disappear. sent that to every news outlet I could think of. They're gonna have it on the loop for a while. And when the people tweak to what it means, Cass is done. He'll be removed, prosecuted for high treason. They'll have no choice. We've done it. Congratulations, team. What's next? That can't be all you brought me on for. There is still the matter of Zero Day. You know, the rogue hacker group that conspired with Cass and Mary Kelly to blow up London. Jesus, Backley, all work and no play. Give the squad a second or two to bask in our victory. Safe to say it won't last long. I doubt this is the reaction you were expecting, but Nigel Cass is in the news again. The government has convened to review its contract with Albion. Nigel Cass himself has responded to requests that he should surrender to the authorities in a heated call with the GBB. Just shut up and listen to me. I will not be removed by the government or anyone else. I will die first. And many will die with me. They're calling for blood. They'll have it. This city belongs to me. I am its shepherd and I will slaughter my flock before I relinquish it. Cass has barricaded himself in his White Tower headquarters and threatened to kill anyone that tries to stop him. He is heavily armed and considered extremely dangerous. Shit. He's gone off the deep end. He's liable to take it to the streets in his state. We have no choice. We have to get to White Tower and stop him. 